Hi everyone, so let's start learning about the assembly language programming for the PIC microcontroller. And first, uh, before starting that obviously first we will understand the different registers that we will be using or the instructions that we use for writing our code. The first and the foremost or widely used instruction is the move literal value to reg. Okay. So move literal value to reg. And what is reg? Reg is actually the working register which is used for performing the arithmetic or logical instructions and it actually stores the result within it. It's an 8-bit register as I mentioned in the previous lecture and uh, if you want to perform any addition or multiplication or division or logical and or you need to involve the reg register in it. Fine. The syntax for this instruction is actually move literal value to reg and here you will be writing down that literal k okay this k can be in the hex or in decimal or it can be certain ascii character fine or a string as well so let's see if i do write it as move literal value to reg and right before it i just mention it as 22 hex it means 22 hex will be stored in the reg register or working register fine and other syntax or the instruction that you need to know is the move reg to file register move reg to file register and we also came to know what are the file register file registers are actually the ram locations that are used for the data storage and the scratch pads or some other purposes and we can address the file registers by directly using their addresses or even we can assign them some names using the equate directives fine we will see further when we will be proceeding to the coming lectures so how we use this instruction we actually write it as move reg to file let's say if i do write the file register from the sfrs which is the port b so what it will do this instruction will put the value of 22 hex in the reg register and this instruction will copy the 22 hex or it will forward the value 22 hex to the port b okay If I do write the instruction like move reg to file and then I mention some constant value let's say 30 hex here. Now what does it mean since we know that whenever we are using this mnemonic like move reg to file it means there is certain file register. Which file register? This file register. So here 30 hex will be acting or it is the location of the file register whose address is 30 hex okay and if we suppose the reg register is containing the same previous value then 30 hex is some memory location in the file register and it will contain the value 22 hex fine now let's see if i do write certain instructions like move reg to file 20 hex and then if I do write again move literal value to reg 33 hex move reg to file 22 hex and then move literal value to reg 40 hex and then move reg to file 29 hex. Now let's see what happens in this case or when these instructions are executed. 
फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू एक्चुअली आइडेंटिफाई विच आर द मेमरी लोकेशंस ऑफ द फाइल रजिस्टर्स सो वेन एवर वी आर यूजिंग दिस इंस्ट्रक्शन रेक टू फाइल द वैल्यू रिटर्न बिफोर इट इज एक्चुअली द मेमरी लोकेशन सो आइडेंटिफाई दोज लोकेशन और दोज इंस्ट्रक्शंस मूव रेक टू फाइल मूव रेक टू फाइल एंड मूव टू रेक टू फाइल सो हाउ मैनी मेमरी लोकेशन वी आर यूजिंग वी आर यूजिंग द मेमरी लोकेशन हैविंग द एड्रेस ऑफ आई विल बी मेकिंग सम कंजेक्टिव मेमरी लोकेशन जस्ट टू सेव दिस स्पेस ओके सो ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू एंड ट्वेंटी नाइन हैक्स सो लेट्स ए हेयर इज सर टेन ट्वेंटी हैक्स लोकेशन हेयर इज सम ट्वेंटी टू हैक्स लोकेशन एंड देन ट्वेंटी नाइन लोकेशन ओवर हेयर दीज आर बेसिकली द एड्रेसिस ओके एंड हेयर दिस इज सर्ट एंड फाइल रजिस्टर नाउ वट वी आर डूइंग इन दिस इंस्ट्रक्शन वी आर मूविंग द वैल्यू ऑफ द रेग टू द फाइल रजिस्टर एंड लेट से इफ वी कंसिडर दिस इज आर फर्स्ट इंस्ट्रक्शन दैन द रेग इज कंटेनिंग ट्वेंटी टू हैक्स सो ट्वेंटी हैक्स लोकेशन विल हैव द वैल्यू ऑफ ट्वेंटी टू हैक्स फाइन सिमिलरली दैन यू प्लेस द लिटरल वैल्यू थर्टी थ्री हैक्स इन टू रैग एंड नाउ यू फॉरवर्डेड इट टू द मेमरी लोकेशन ट्वेंटी टू सो ट्वेंटी टू हैक्स लोकेशन विल बी हैविंग थर्टी थ्री हैक्स वैल्यू सिमिलरली इफ यू हैव प्लेसड फोर्टी हैक्स इन द रेग रजिस्टर दैन यू कॉपीड इट इन टू द ट्वेंटी नाइन हैक्स सो ट्वेंटी नाइन हैक्स मेमरी लोकेशन विल कन स्टोर दिस वैल्यू ओके फोर्टी हैक्स सो इन दिस वे दीज टू इंस्ट्रक्शन मूव लिटरल वैल्यू टू रेग और मूव रेग टू फाइल वर्क दिस इज आर एस एफ आर while 30 hex is r 30 hex or 20 hex 22 hex 29 hex they all are the gprs or general purpose registers okay the next instruction that you should remember is the i'll be writing here which is the add lw what does it mean now Add literal value to the reg register. Which literal value? Let's say fifty nine hex. So if reg is containing already certain value, this fifty nine hex will be added into it. Now let's just write some instructions and see what happens. If you have written like this, add literal value to reg fifty nine hex, then move reg to file forty eight hex. and then move literal value to reg which is equal to 38 hex and then add literal value to reg 59 hex move reg to file which is 70 hex and then another instruction is add reg to file which file register here you actually write the file register it's the syntax and you mention d here okay this is very interesting instruction because it will do what its task remain same means it will add the value of the reg into the file so reg will be added into the file register which file register that you will be writing just before it and the resultant obviously we will get some result this result will be stored according to the value of this d bit okay if d is equal to 1 then the resultant will be stored into the file register and if d is equal to 0 the resultant will be stored in the reg register and if you do not write d over here then by default the resultant will be stored into the reg register okay or you can also write uh, the alphabet for the differentiation 
means if you write f over here it means the resultant will be the file register if you write w over here it means the resultant will be stored into the reg register so let's say if i do write another instruction over here add reg to file and it is 13 hex comma f then add reg to file it's at reg to file let's say 70 hex comma w then let's see what will be the output of this program now we will uh, go through the instruction wise now what happens add literal value to reg so whatever the reg register is containing 59 hex will be added into it let's suppose the reg register is initially cleared so move literal value to reg 0 means reg register contents are initially 0 and then you added 59 hex into it so reg is equal to 59 hex fine then what you did move reg to file fine so you actually took the file location which is 48 hex let's say over here and you copied the rec contents into it which is equal to 59 hex in this case fine then what you did move literal value to rec which value 38 hex now reg is containing 38 hex and then what you did you added 59 hex into it so 38 plus 59 which is equal to 97 okay add literal value to reg register so reg will be containing now 97 97 hex and then you did move reg to file register so 70 hex is the memory location again somewhere over here and you actually moved the reg contents into it which is 97 hex in this case okay the next instruction is saying add reg to file okay now whatever the reg uh, is, uh, register is containing you are going to add it into the file register which file register the 13 hex memory location file register so let's assume that here was some 13 hex memory location which was containing 20 hex fine so 30 hex location was containing 20 hex and you are going to add 20 hex into the contents of the reg register and if you remember the reg register was containing 97 hex okay so we will add 97 hex to 20 hex and obviously you will get 107 hex which will be present in the reg and the destination will be now the file register so the contents of the file register will now update it and the 30 hex will be containing 107 hex fine now move to the next instruction add reg to file again which file register 70 hex so let's assume that here is the 70 hex memory location okay and it is containing what it's containing 97 hex and you are going to what you are going to add the reg contents which is equal to 90 107 and you are going to add 97 into it so 7 7 are 14 9 0 basically 10 2 0 4 hex and where it will be stored it will be stored now into the reg register so the file register contents will now not be updated they will remain as it is while the reg register will be containing 204 hex fine so in this way we use these instructions 
for manipulating the memory and the rec register thank you for watching and wait for the coming lectures for learning the assembly language programming if you have any question you can drop your queries in the comment section bye